Top 10 Tactics Used by the Secret Service That Will Blow Your Mind There are many secret services that are assigned for the protection of a particular person. Take for example the President of the US. He is one of the most protected persons in the world and this cannot be done without a special power that works in silence. Hey guys, we're back with a new video. If you want to blow your mind about the tactics used by the Secret Service, stay with us until the end of the video. Watch out for the number one tactic on our list because it could overwhelm your mind to the level of disbelief. So make sure you start the video by hitting the like button. Alright, grab yourself some popcorn and let's get right to what you're all here for. Number 10. Rigorous Training The first thing worth knowing is that there is no sworn oath to die for the president. Despite the fact that the Secret Service makes every effort to protect the President, agents never have to explicitly swear to give up their lives to protect the President. While it is understood that something like this could happen, it is still normal to do everything in one's power to avoid it. But to be prepared for anything, agents should undergo regular scenario training where they act as stand-ins for the President while other agents try to evade the threats. This tactic is actually great for sharpening their minds. Interestingly, the training includes non-lethal marker bullets. And by that, I mean they actually get hit by plastic bullets that leave a colored trail and a superficial sting. This tactic is amazing for knowing if you are hit or where you hit your target. Trust me, those bullets hit a lot harder than paintball bullets. I absolutely would not want to be hit by a plastic bullet like that. Or a bullet in general. Number 9. Ink Library You'd never know it until you're told that even inked papers could be the clues that save the president from an assassination attempt. The lab's ink library contains more than 15,000 samples of pen, marker, and printer ink dating back to the 1920s. The main purpose of this library is to handle threat letters. In short, the Secret Service uses this huge ink library to catch forged documents. They have a huge database of tags in the ink, and using these tags, they can trace the brand of any type of ink. They can also trace where that brand is sold in the country. Also, they have a team of handwriting experts ready to inspect the handwriting of any letter with a threatening word in it. It's cool how a threatening letter or warning letter can cause the attack to fail. Number 8. Protective Intelligence Social media platforms are full of every type of personality. Some of them can sound rude and threatening to the president when they have no intention of doing so, and it doesn't matter if a threat seems serious or is a joke. As soon as someone types that they want the president to leave, they fall under the list of people being investigated. Every aspect of that person is investigated, from family and neighbors to friends and employees. All may be questioned until they decide whether or not the person should be warned or if further action should be taken. He may eventually be convicted of a Class E felony. Number 7. Motorcade the President's most widely used mode of transportation is known by the name The Beast. Although the name says it all, I will give you some facts about it. First, the presidential limousine, The Beast, is always accompanied by a group of vehicles that cost about $2,800 per minute to drive. The column consists of a discreet black van containing the counterinsurgency team, which we will talk about in a moment. An electronic surveillance van to stop any IEDs is also always present. Then, there are three security cars and a hazardous materials car, in case of chemical or nuclear risks. Did I mention the ID car for communications? Now you know why it looks like a parade when the president is on the road. Number 6. Cat Agents This one is very interesting because cat agents might be your next interest. CAT stands for Counter Assault Team. You can read about them, but the research will be quite long. They are actually a level up from the Secret Service and work for them. With Hawkeye-like characteristics, these agents specialize in the tactical front lines to protect the President. If the President is attacked, troops try to get him to safety. The cat immediately confronts the threat with an incredible amount of suppressive fire. They carry SR-16, and to get to that level, you must first endure a week of pre-training before being promoted to an intensive six-week training camp. Their training includes exercises such as running a mile and a half in 9 minutes or wearing a 45-pound vest. To be highly proficient with weapons, they must also be highly intelligent during their training. 
Number 5. Water Rescue Being president involves not only high security on the road, but also lifetime protection, even when he retires. You heard me right. The president of the U.S. is protected even after his time as president. Even near bodies of water, special agents are deployed for rescue operations. These agents accompany the president, active or not, to any place with water. This means that they are well trained in all the dangers that water poses. Did you guys already know that? Here's a bonus fact absolutely free! Service agents are very well trained to look for weapons in a crowd. That's also why they always wear dark sunglasses so they can keep an eye on a suspect without that person knowing. So you may not notice that a person next to you has his hands in his pockets, but the service agents would already be alert. Number 4. Assassin Interviews You never know how cold the water is until you step in. That is exactly the case here and you will know that there is no better way to know how killers operate than to ask them. Secret Service agent Tim Wood reported that many killers are interviewed every month, including those who have served time in prison for their crimes. All the details that the criminals tell are thoroughly written down and they look for links to certain murders that have happened recently. Who knows, they may end up revealing a tip to the Secret Service. Number 3. Food Surveillance what if I told you that every bite of food presented to the president is prepared under the watchful eye of the Secret Service? If you saw the video from yesterday, then you know that this also happens to dictator Kim Jong-un. If you still believed that the president has a special food taster, you may be disappointed because the Secret Service agents continue to stare at the food that the White House cooks make. That's not exactly unexpected, but what if the president suddenly craves fast food? Well, they do that by just ordering the food at the Naval Observatory or some other address because the restaurant doesn't know who it's for, which reduces the danger. Number 2. Advancement Team If you imagine a group of special forces going out when the president gets up, you are wrong. There is a team known for checking the destination hours before the president arrives. Checking rooftops and even bathrooms may be obvious to us, but the fact that they obtain information about recently released mental patients in the nearby hospitals is next level. Even hotels hate them. The advancement team takes over the hotel where the president is to stay and do a full search of each room. In addition, they also do a background check on every hotel employee. Isn't it amazing how complicated the whole procedure can be? When the president is staying at the hotel, no one is allowed to use the elevators except the president himself and the hotel manager also asks anyone with a criminal record not to enter that day. Number 1. 10-Minute Medicine No doubt the Secret Service is trained in emergency medical procedures, but this protocol of 10-minute medical intervention can only be applied to the president. If the president is attacked or suffers some other medical emergency, this protocol ensures that he survives long enough to go to a trauma center. It is crazy that the Secret Service travels with bags of blood with plasma matching the president's type strapped to the trunk of the car. The limos are built from the ground up in addition to the extra armor and security features. In short, the 10-minute medicine includes every procedure to keep the president alive until he can get help from other medical professionals. Also, the Secret Service keeps track of where the nearest medical facility is within a 10-minute radius of where the president travels. Let's just say they are great people with extraordinary abilities. Well, this brings us to the end of our video. Although these protocols might sound reasonable to you because the president is very important, yet some of these interventions are extreme enough to blow your mind. Now, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to drop a like and be sure to subscribe to our channel. As well, don't forget to turn on our post notifications so that you never miss an upload. Have you ever wondered which cities are better not to go to? Then make sure to tune in tomorrow because in that video we will discuss 10 abandoned cities you should never visit in your life. Alright guys, see you tomorrow.